Hello everybody, my name is Ro Chris, and welcome back to some Let's Play Beyond Skyrim Bruma. In the last video, we wiped out a coven of necromancers and almost died a couple times. In this video, we are going to be cleaning up some stuff. Specifically, a Stormcloak and Chains, since I have improved my interrogation skills via the console, I know. It's cheating, but I want to be able to do everything in this without having to grind my way through it. I just don't have the time to do that. I'm a student, and I got other things to do. <laughs> So I just use the console. If you're enjoying the videos, guys, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Click the notification bell. And if you really want to go the extra mile to help me grow, share it with somebody that you would think is interested. Don't just try to get people to subscribe who aren't going to actually watch the video. That doesn't really help. But if you know somebody's going to enjoy my stuff, share it with them. And maybe they'll subscribe. Now, let's get in here and interrogate this guy. I went in the wrong door. Wait, what? I thought the door to the prison was... Oh no, never mind. I'm being silly. Alright, let's head down here and see what he's got going on. Now hopefully, it doesn't matter that I failed the speech check earlier and this guy will actually listen to me. What have you come down with? Ataxia? Rock joint. I can see you're not well. It's in your best interest to comply. It penetis oculatus? After me? Oh, by Talos. What have I done? What have I gotten myself into? Fine, fine, I'll comply. I mean, no I won't. Talos, I... Oh, by the divines. Alright, tell me, why did you cross the border? Because Skyrim is suffering under the Empire's yoke. We're not even allowed to worship our own damned gods. You wouldn't understand. You're an Imperial dog. A toady for the Dalmor. But we deserve freedom! And to truly achieve freedom, we need to end the Empire. Strike at its heart. Cyrodiil, the Imperial City, and the rest will crumble. Oh, Talos, here comes the damn jail. Someone else to rub salt in the wound. Is there anything else we can get from this guy? No. Better than any of the other sops that I've tried, at any rate. Jailer, come to gawk at the poor, helpless storm cloak. You'll pay, damned Imperial! You'll all pay! <laughs> you say that every day. Still haven't found a way to break through those bars, though, have you? The information you've gotten out of him so far? Good work. You've gotten the basics out of him, but the Legate needs to know everything we can possibly extract. So, well, best not let the prisoner hear our little chat. Follow me. Farewell. Alright. So now we have to follow this guy into his bedroom. That's a little sketchy. Can I help you? Um, yeah, actually by hurrying up so we can talk about this. Good morning. Good morning. I'm gonna get a save here real quick for the thumbnail. Oh, do you, like, sleep here? That's cool. You gonna talk to me or something? Hello. I thought we there needed we to get away from prying ears. Last thing we need is to let the prisoner in on our techniques. Now we know the guy's plot. Heard it straight from the horse's mouth. But we need to know more. This time you need to take on a few different lines of attack. Find out who sent him. If he came with anyone else, and where they may be. And try not to lose track of time. The Petitus Oculatus will be here soon, and the Legate wants us to get the information out of him, not them. Good luck. Talk to you later. Alright, now we go back in here and interrogate some more. You know what? While you were back there exchanging poisonous words with your jailer friend, I've decided 
I'm not talking. Mm-hmm. No more. Whose orders do you follow? It's in your interest to comply. Fine, fine. I crossed the border through Serpent's Trail. An old smuggling route. I... We're not part of the main Stormcloak army. At least, not anymore. We call ourselves the Stormcloak Breakaways. Don't resist. Tell me the whereabouts of your accomplices, too. Fine, fine. I'll tell you everything, silver-tongued scamp. There are others. Not sure how many. I was never in command. Just their forward scout. One of them, at any rate. But I know of at least six others. Three of them crossed the border. Came down here, not reported back in weeks. The others, three of them, waiting on the Skyrim side of the border, lying in wait, waiting for my report. Given that I've been stuck in here for days, bet they're running out of patience right quick. Let's end this interrogation here. Go pff yourself, man. All right. But he has connections. The prisoner is part of an organization called the Stormcloak Breakaways. Stormcloak Breakaways, eh? Hmm. So even Ulfric Stormcloaks aren't extreme enough for some of his flunkies. Pfft. Stir crazy Nords. He has six accomplices, maybe more. Six accomplices? Hmm. Not quite an army, but a formidable force given a clever and able commander. That's all I know. I see. Well, thank you, I... What the... Quick, follow me. Disturbance? Oh, no. Quickly, get the door open! For the jailer and his little bootlicker come back! Shut up and keep it down! I'm working on it. But turns out, buying stacks of black market invisibility potions leaves little coin for lockpicks. What was that? Just a bruise. So I was hoping we could actually. Oh, I hope that doesn't make that guy aggro to me. I was hoping we could have some dialogue with this dude, but apparently we just have to kill him. Don't hurt. Send us mercy, Stormcloak. Reach the fort. I'll stand watch here and keep an eye on that damned prisoner. Go. Let him know what's going on. Alright. Find and warn Legate Priscilius Vero. He's probably outside. Wonder if they're gonna be like fighting. Oh, more storm folks. These guys are actually kind of tough. Go back to Black Marsh. Scale back. No, now you're just being racist. But I guess that's just kind of their thing, right? Since this is out of charge, switch to my shield. You'll never have your life. Are you ready to die today? No. I think you are though, right? I'm done. All right, where is Priscilius? What's going on here? Oh yeah, like I said, battle. Although there's just one of these guys, so maybe I should let them handle it. Soldier, report. Where's the prisoner? Still in his cell. That's a relief. Hmm. I guess these blasted stormcloaks are trying to rescue that damned prisoner. Divides forsake them, and Dagon take them. Stay on alert, everyone. Might be more stormcloaks yet. Observe what is happening. Oh, yep, the Penitus Oculatus. The Penitus. 
Penitus Oculatus. Yes, yes. We are the Penitus Oculatus. A thrill for soldiers posted in a frigid backwater such as this, I'm sure. The prisoner. Now, Varro. I... this one. Here. I hired them to interrogate him after our own efforts proved fruitless. I suggest you two have a conversation first. The Legate's disobeying command. You can't simply let him... Enough. Come then, let us speak. And see whether or not your findings are as interesting as the Legate seems to believe. So, what did you discover? How many accomplices does he have? Where are they active? What faction does he belong to? This guy looks angry. The Stormcloak Breakaways, they're active on both sides of the border. Stormcloak Breakaways. Interesting. But more importantly, accomplices. While this ill-fated little prison break revealed that much, the prisoner's confession suggests more widespread activity than previously assumed. Ah, it seems the prisoner's here now. Your operation is quite efficient. Where is he? Oh, coming from down there. So I was right, you could get to the prison from there. Are you really going to take him away? His plot was stupid. There's no way he could have done it. He might be insane for all we know. The security of the Empire comes before all else, Legate. You will come to understand this in time. You there! You may be a lapdog of the Imperials, but it's not too late! Put down these damned Imperials! Free me! Don't let them cart me away! Enough of these foolish overtures. This way. What's going on, man? I have... I'm not going to slay them. So I guess I just sit here and watch. Seems like they're giving me plenty of time to make my decision. Hello. Goodbye. Is anything gonna happen? This is the second video in a row that we've had some glitches. So I guess I'll just cut until something happens. Oh, they disappeared. All right then. Uh, not exactly the outcome I was hoping for, but the Empire is what it is. The best damned hope for Tamriel, warts and all. Still, you did what I asked of you and accomplished it well. Here's your payment. I'll try not to think of the poor guy's fate. Not even. I love how he's just walking through doors while he's doing this. All right. Um. You seem a little. Fevered. Perhaps you should go get some rest? Oh yeah, I'm all sorts of messed up. I found Heron. He joined the Stormcloaks and was killed. Damn. Damn it all. This war turns brother against brother even outside of Skyrim. I knew my men. They were loyal. They were honorable. Thank you for telling me this. But please, don't tell anyone else. I'm going to have to bring this to the attention of my superiors. Alright, that's that for this quest. So, what's next on the docket? We don't have anything going on in here. So, well, we can collect these payments. So, I guess I'll do that. Kind of just wrapping things up at this point in the Let's Play. I mean, I have a few quests that we still have to do, so it's probably going to be like four or five more episodes before I finish it in total. I am excited to finish it. I want to get some other new content going. See if it gets any traction. What is it? Alright, I'm here to collect payment from Rosada. We've heard this before, Thanks. so I'm just going to skip I've through it. He's in reality, so no. I don't think I'll be giving him his money. I'm just a messenger. Please don't complicate things for me. Oh. I suppose. It would be fairly short-sighted of me to complicate your responsibilities any further because of Razada's 
questionable product. Fine, here's the coin. But deliver my complaint to Razada. Pretty good. Alright, now to talk to the psychopath down here, Razada. Rizada the Resplendent, Enchanter Extraordinaire, Illusionist Incredible, Restorer Remarkable and Destructor, Distinguished, at your service. That's all the payments, right? Indeed it is. <clears throat> Why are you looking at me like that? Go on, shoo! My reward? Ah, right, that uh, <clears throat> small matter almost slipped my mind. <laughs> Here. Take this spell tome. I came up with the spell myself, you know. <laughs> to conjure a zombie. Ooh. <laughs> I modified the standard spell to make it more effective. And I believe you will like the results. Spell tome. Cowardly zombie thrall added. That's wonderful. Let me guess, it just like runs away from everybody. Someone's a cowardly zombie permanently. Alright, sorry about that, guys. Where did I leave off with my controller disconnecting? There we go. Alright. Um, what should we do next? What do you guys think? I know there's a um place down here that we can check out, so I'll probably do that now. I think there's a quest down here to do with it, too. We were about to come across it as we were walking to the other area. Oh, yeah. I think that's it on the map. I could be totally wrong. And we can use this way shrine to cure our diseases. So I have no idea what this place actually is. I have just was looking up stuff on Google of what I have left to do in this. So if I'm correct, this is some sort of apple orchard. Oh, what the heck, guys? Stop attacking her. You'd think they would attack the traveler and not the poor girl that's prisoned. I thought that was the end. Thank you, traveler. Here, have some of the herbs I found before they assaulted me. Bye. Alright, so that's one of the things that I can cross off the list because that was something that I found when I was researching. Alright, up next we have Greenwood, which, yep, I believe is the apple orchard. Is there apple trees anywhere? Maybe I'm wrong. I knew it said there was apiaries here and I thought there were supposed to be apple trees, but who knows. Greenwood Meadery. Welcome to Greenwood. We don't have much in the way of lodgings. Are you here for our delicious Greenwood Mead or just to enjoy the sights? Welcome to the finest meadery in Cyrodiil. So this is where Greenwood Mead comes from. Yes, indeed. An old family recipe. Well, I say old. Amiel came up with it. He's father. Well, father-in-law. Gets sold all over Cyrodiil. The mead, I mean. Not my father. <laughs> tell me about the history of this place. My father-in-law, Amiel, can tell you that better than I. He lives around here. Go, ask him. Goodbye. Can I help you? Got any work available? Perhaps. We tend to draw our water from the nearby river, but the source is, sadly, currently infested with ogres. Strong brutes they are, let me tell you. Since we'd rather not get mauled by ogres, we haven't tried to clear them out. We're just normal people, not warriors. We've been hoping for a mercenary to happen by so we could get this problem sorted out. But not many tend to come around here. What do you say? There'll be coin involved. Sure, I'll clear the ogres out. Great. There'll be some good coin in it for you if you return successful. The source is northeast of here. A river. Be careful. All right, so are you here for our delicious greenwood mead or just to soak in the atmosphere of the great forest? So I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did 
leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one goodbye hello everybody my name is Jarl chris and you just finished watching one of my videos obviously if you made it this far you probably enjoyed it so if you did leave a like and subscribe for more leave a comment down below if you have any advice for me or if you want to see something else and you need to tell me other than that hope you have a nice rest of your day see you again bye bye